you know, we can use the water bottles or the, or the tins from your press. So here's my dumbbells. Um, if you have a kettlebell, you know, you can use a kettlebell as well. If you don't, you can use the dumbbells for the same exercise that we're going to be using this for. If you don't have any kettlebells or dumbbells and you want to make something with a little bit of a resistance or weight, you can get a, one second now, stay with me. The one I have here is a little reusable shopping bag, couple of bottles of water, two bottles of water, throw them into the bag, and you have a makeshift, you have a makeshift kettlebell, okay? And if you want, you can add more, you can put some tins, peas, beans, whatever, if you don't have any water bottles, but it's just, it's just handy if you want to do something. Um, if you want to make uh, a homemade uh, resistance or a uh, weight for some exercise. Um, anything else? Yeah, so that's all we kind of need for today. The small dumbbells or the kettlebell or alternatively tins or water bottles. That's it. That's all we need for today. So I hope you're all keeping well. Well done on the first week. This is the beginning of week two. Let's uh, continue with the same effort, the same um, attitude, just breaking it down one day at a time. And we're doing it. We're flying. So I'm ready to get going. So whenever you whenever you think we should head, we should get going, Anna, just give me the nod, please. Yeah, we might just give it another minute. Um, if I could just ask everybody to make sure that they're muted, that would be great. Please, just to get rid of the distractions of noise. So just make sure you're muted. Um, we might just give it another minute, Eric. Yeah, 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 take your time. That's fine. Okay, Eric, if you want to kick off and get going if everyone is ready, um, yeah, I will hand it over to you. Okay. Welcome, everybody. Well done on your first week. And here's to another great week. Well done. Absolutely, yeah. Okay, so once again, then we're going to just start off a nice little warm up, loosen out, and we're going to go to a little boxing, kickboxing, and, and then we're going to do some circuits, all right? So, just remember, go at your own pace all the time. Go at your own pace. Feel comfortable. Make sure you have a water bottle with you. And um, if you don't have an exercise mat, just maybe a towel or something like that, okay? All right. So we're going to start off rolling out one ankle. I get the time going now for a little warm-up. And the opposite direction. Yep, the opposite direction. And the other foot. The other foot, the other ankle. And the opposite direction. Slowly. Okay, two feet together, up and down. Up and down, two feet together, up and down. That's it. And left and right. 
left and right, sway from side to side. Okay, feet together, roll your knees, roll the knees, let's go, roll it all around, roll it. And back the other way. That's it. Okay, feet apart, let's roll out the hips. Nice and easy. We're, we're just loosening the, the joints <clears throat> and then we're going to start warming up the major muscles. Getting really nice and loosened up and nice, um, nice and warm. Okay, let's go with the, sh the shoulders. Oh, full circles. And the other way. <clears throat> That's it. That's it. It's a great way to start our week as well. Monday morning, get the exercise done. Feel great for the rest of the day. And your week is off to a great start. We're rolling the necks now, just nice and easy. Don't jerk it. Very good. Up and down. Up and down. Here we go. Left and right. Left and right. Change side by side. We're til tilting our heads now. Left and right. Very good. Okay, shake it out, guys. Shake out your body. <coughs> Very good. Okay, shake it all out. Okay, nice and easy. We're going to kick the legs up behind. Or you can stand. Remember, you can stand or you can kick, okay? Legs up behind. Very good. Okay, knees. Knees, front. And shake it. Shake it out. Shake it, shake it, shake it out. Very good. Okay, jumping jacks. Let's go. One, two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Change under two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Shake it out. Shake it, shake it, shake it. Good. Come towards me and behind. Change over and behind. Come towards me and behind. Change over and behind. Keep changing. Nearly there. And back one more time. Good. And change. Knee. Knee up. Hop. 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 Let's go. Hop. 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 Push it up. Come on. That's it. That's it. Shake it out. Shake it out. One arm, full extension, full extension. That's it. Go a little bit easy on your feet now, a little bit easy on your feet. You can just keep, you can keep stepping, but we're not bouncing. The other arm, or sorry, behind the other direction. Now, the other arm, the other arm, let's go. Full extension and behind. Good. Okay, two together. Let's go. Bend the legs and up. Bend them up. Come on. Here we go. And behind. That's it. Elbows. Elbows. Let's go. Roll out those elbows. Inside. Opposite direction. Here we go. That's it, guys. Keep it going. Roll out the hands and wrists now. Roll them out, hands and wrists. Join them up together. Loosen out the wrists. There we go. Shake them out. Shake them out. Brush hair. Let's go. Brush hair. One over, then the other. Come. Up, up. And behind. And behind. Come on. Lovely, lovely work. Come on, we're going great. 
Yeah, keep it going there now, folks. Okay, ready? Left up to right. Then the other side. Left up to right, right up to left. Get a nice stretch on your hamstring. When you kick it up, get a nice stretch on your hamstring. Up. Up. Good. Up. Now change it a little bit, elbow to knee, cross your body. Cross your body. Same thing, instead of hand to foot, it's elbow to knee. But we don't hit the elbow, we don't hit the elbow off the knee, we go across it. Across, cross. And you feel a nice little stretch on your lower back when you turn into it. Okay? Okay, good. Change now. I want you to step in, just nice and easy stepping. And as you're stepping, I want your hands sliding down, your right hand down your right leg left hand down the side of your left leg and you're opening up your obliques get in a nice stretch okay so one two one two one two you'll raise one hand up one hand down one hand up one hand down good okay jumping jacks come on That's it, that's it, that's brilliant. Brilliant work, guys. Shake it out, shake it out. Okay, bouncing. Everybody bouncing. Come on, bounce. That's it, bounce. Come on, let's go. Forward and back. Forward and back, come on. Up, forward and back. Keep your two feet together. Two feet together, let's go. Forward, back. Okay, side by side. Side by side, left and right. Come on, bounce. Ready? Forward, back, side by side. Forward, back, side by side. Let's go. Nearly there, come on. Whew. Okay, shake it out, shake it out, shake it out. And the final little part of our warm up, the final little part, easy, easy. We're going to do a couple of little bursts. So for now, everybody easy. Let's go. Easy, easy, easy. Ready? Go! Three, two, one. Easy. Easy. Easy again now. Ready? Go! Three, two, one. Easy for the last time. Easy for the last time. And go. Three, two, one. Time. Get a breather, get a drink. That's it. Get a breather. Get a drink. Okay, I'll talk you through the next little part, guys. Um, yes, yeah, so I'm going to talk you through the next part. So, we're going to do uh, the circuits like we did the last time, 25 25 seconds of action, seven seconds rest. Okay. So 25 action, seven seconds rest. I have that set up now. Our four exercises are, first one, which are dumbbells or your water bottles or whatever you have. We're gonna stand straight. We're going to point our fists up to the sky and point our elbows down to the floor like this. And then we're going to punch 
uh, overhead press. Okay, overhead press. Okay, I'll just move up the screen just a little tiny bit just because I know my hands are kind of going out of the screen a little bit. So, <laughs> yeah, overhead press. When you punch up, your hands, your palms of your hands face out. When you come back down, your palms of your hands face your cheeks. You face your cheeks, your jaw. Out, back in. Out, back in. So palms facing out. So your palms are facing me when you go up and facing your face when you go back in. Okay. Now, second one is squats. But this time you can you can put down the water balls. Squats with a leg raise. Squats with a leg raise. But remember, if that's too difficult, just do a normal squat. So <clears throat> you can just do normal squats. But this one is squat, lateral raise, squat, lateral raise. So your leg goes out and just out a little bit, not higher than, you know, just up to kind of like your hip level, even a bit lower. Now your third one is your front lifts. So palms facing your body, shoulder height reach up, shoulder height. So your palms of your hands are facing your body, raising up to your shoulders with your peas or your tins or water bottle, whatever it is you have. Then your last one is the center plank. Ready? Your next one is the center plank after that. So we're all going to go together and we're going to go for here for the first one. Ready now? We're going to get the time. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Up, up, let's go. Facing out in front. Come on. Lovely work, guys. Keep breathing all the way through, nice and relaxed. That's it. Enjoy it. And relax, a little relax. Next one, remember squats. Squats, lateral raise. Squats, lateral raise. Come on. Come on, do great. And back up the dumbbells or water balls now. Ready? Let's go, front lift. And we're doing great. We keep this going for this week 25 seconds, seven seconds rest. And then next week, we might move it up to 30 seconds action and we keep the seven seconds rest as well. So, okay, good. Next is center plank. Ready? Let's go. I say, hold it together now. Come on, guys, keep breathing. That's it, keep breathing. That's it. Focus, stay strong, stable, engage your core, stay strong around your back, and relax. We're back to the first one. We're back to the overhead, do you remember? Ready? Let's go. There you go, keep pushing. That's it, keep pushing. And relax. We're on the squats, remember the squats with the leg raise. Ready, here we go.
Okay, we're back to the front lifts. Front lifts, one at a time. Go. Shoulder height. Stay strong, keep your back strong. Good balance. Just your arms is doing the work and your front muscles around your abs. You can feel the little pull as you go up with your arm, the little pull across your, across your midsection, across the front of your body and your chest, okay? Sometimes it depends on the resistance of, your, of the weight in your hands. Okay, center plank, let's go. Last one, come on. We can get a breather after this, come on. That's it, that's brilliant. Breathe. And relax. Okay, well done, we have our first circuit done. Little breather everybody. Little breather, little drink of water. And I'm going to talk about round two now, okay? Okay, so we've got lateral moves. So from left to right, up, up, up. That's number one. Okay, that's number one. Number two is punches. Boom, 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 boom. With your water or your tids, that's number two. Number three is a little bit of cardio. Knee pop, 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 like we did for the warm up, okay? That's number three. And number four is heel touch. So you sit down like this, this position, feet, that, feet flat, right hand to right heel, left hand to left heel. And you come up and back, up and back, up and back getting a little crunch across your midsection every time. If your feet are too far away, you won't reach. Bring your feet in close to your backside. Bring the bottom of your feet in close so you can reach your heel and get a nice crunch, uh, crunch and feeling across, across your uh, stomach, okay? Right, so everybody ready? We're gonna start in five. Four, three, sorry, let me just quickly, very quickly change this. Um, to make sure I'm in the right position and everything. Five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. That's it, that's very good, keep it going. And get your dumbbells for the punches next. Here we go, let's go. Punching out, come on. That's it, come on. Get your King Taylor effect on. Oosh, 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 oosh. <laughs> okay, what's next? Oh yes. Knee bump, let's go. Hop, 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 hop.
Good work. One more time. Let's go. We're going back to the start. Ready? Go. That's it. Come on. Keep it going. Come on. Keep it going. And change punches. Ready. And go. Everybody's feeling good. You're uh, you're jumping around there. You look like you've loads of energy anyway. It's all very good. It's all very positive. Going to get a little. Uh, going to get a little. Uh, just a little picture for the social media. And uh, don't worry, you won't be. You're going to be so far back. You won't. We won't be identified. It'll be just little boxes. But if you do get a chance when you're out doing your walking or whatever, and I know a couple of people do tag the Kildare Sports Partnership or tag myself and mention Operation Transformation or whatever, it's just good. It sends out a good message. It sends out a message of, you know, this is what we're doing, you know, and it kind of maybe will entice other people to get out. I think it's very good because we see a hell of a lot of um, negative to share positive messages too and what we're doing is very very positive so yeah if you if, look feel free to do that uh, you don't have to it's very, it's optional but if, if you're if you're a social media user you know giving out give it giving out an old plug here and there it'll be good okay so i'm just going to get a quick picture from back here thank you Now, number three coming up, and number three is your first, your three exercises or four exercises are number one, high knees. You can jog or you can march. You decide. Number two is so we're doing the pull-ups. So you can use the kettlebell or we're pulling up like this, okay, elbows out, or you can use your little, uh, your shopping bag, whatever it is, pull it up, okay? Um, so that's number two. Number three is the side plank, and remember, you can do the full plank with the assistance, or you can do the modified plank from your knees up, 
we are still doing a good bit of work, okay? We'll do one side, then we'll do the other side. Ready? So, first things first. High knees for everyone. Three, we're gonna go in three, two, one, and we're up. Keep working, keep working. Don't worry about tempo. Just good. Next one, pull ups. Ready? Let's go. Pull it straight up from the bottom right up to your to your chin. Bring your hands up to your chin. Don't hit them off your chin. Just out in front of your face. Elbows up. Good. And you feel the front muscles being used. Your lats, your triceps, your shoulders. Very, very good. Now change. Side plank. Ready? Go. Side plank, everybody. Excuse me. Come on. Come on, you can do it now, come on. We're doing great. I said, keep it up. And the other side, the other side. Let's go. Come on, everyone. That's it, come on. That's it, guys. Keep working. Keep pushing. And we're back to the first one. What was it? High knees. Ready? High knees. Here we go. Come on. Keep it going. Keep working. Come on. Change. We're going tricep pull ups. Ready? Go. Well done. Brilliant. Back to the planks. Two more. Let's go. And we're up. That's it. Come on. That's it, guys. Excellent work. And the other side, last one. Come on, we get a breather after this one. And we're off. We're off, come on. Everybody's doing great. You always feel much better after it's done. You always feel like a great sense of achievement or satisfaction. I time think of it. Um, as as long as I've been working in the area of health and fitness, and I set up um, I set up some fitness classes back in. 2014, I, I, it was 2014, I think, when I started doing fitness classes for the first time. And in all those years, seven years, I've yet to meet one person 
who has regretted doing the class. You know, so that just shows you they might have regretted not doing the class, but you know, there might be, I've even seen some people in cranky form, really like moody form coming into the class, but then going out like a pep in their step, whistling and buzzing, you know, cause that's what it does. That's what exercise does for us. We release the endorphins, we get the heart rate pumping, we get a bit of the, the adrenaline flowing and the juices flowing, and we feel good. We feel good about ourselves. You know, so just remember that sometimes when we're having like, you know, maybe a bad day or whatever, get up, get out, get walking, brisk walking or whatever, or put on your, your social media or put on your YouTube and look for a, a, a workout class or something that you can do, yoga, whatever, anything at all. It does not matter. But when you get the body moving, you will benefit. You will benefit immensely. Okay, so we're on to... We're on to uh, round number four. Okay, so this one here, the first exercise here, you're going to need a towel or an exercise mat because you're going to be on your knees on the ground. And I don't want you to hurt your knees, so you might need to overlap the towel or double it up or fold it up. Um, so I'm going to talk you through it. The first one is I have an exercise mat. So I'm on my knees on the mat. And I'm standing, up, up, and then I'm back down on my knees. Then I'm changing, standing, back down. And I keep changing what leg I come up. Right, left, back down. Left, right, back down. Okay, that's number one. Uh, next one is wide extensions. Remember the wide arms, extensions, little small circles with your tins or your weights. Okay, then number three is deep, deep squat. Knee pump with a stand. Deep squat, knee pump with a stand. And then your final one, your final one is reverse, reverse sit-ups. Lift your hips off the ground. Roll your knees into your chest and let your hips come off the ground. Key points. Leave your head down and leave your hands down. And then roll, okay? And roll. Okay. It's a... Uh, it's a reverse, a reverse roll, okay? Right, everybody ready? We're gonna go in five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Knees up, up. Okay, so what these are called is they're called prisoner, prisoner stand or prisoner steps. <laughs> so we're all prisoners now in our own homes. <laughs> it could be a lot worse. <laughs> Come on, let's go. <laughs> okay, that's it. Shaker. We kind of are anyway with the whole coronavirus thing. But hey, it's not gonna stop us. Let's go, wide extensions. It's not gonna stop us from working out. It's not gonna stop us from stay getting mentally and physically strong. Yes. You can change direction anytime you want. Forward and back. And change. Okay, deep squat. You ready? Feet flat. Sit right down and stand with a knee pump. Stand with a knee pump. Down, stand. Down between your legs. Down between your feet. Boom. Stay nice and strong, especially on the leg that you're going to be standing on when you come up. Use your hands for balance in the air. And change. Now, reverse sit-ups. Let's go. Leave your head down and roll back. That's it, use a focus, bring all of your attention to your ab muscles. Let your abs roll your hip, roll your knees in, okay? Focus your attention there. Good, let's go back to the prisoner steps. Okay, here we go. 
And we're off. Up, up. That's it. Keep changing the side you come up. Good work, good work, come on. Not allowed to use your hands. Keep your hands up, come on. That's it. We're doing it, folks. We're flying. And change. Okay. Wide extensions. Wide extensions, here we go. Yes, that's it, keep it going. And change direction if you want. Woo, that's a tough one, isn't it? Okay, deep squat, knee pump. Remember, stay very strong. Go. Lovely. Good, okay, next one. Um, reverse sit-ups. Let's go, last one. Very good. This really gets us really high on the abs high around the midsection and uh, it's very good strengthens up our back as well because we're we're exercising our back as well as our core as well as our abs very good lip breather okay going to give you a little tip while we're here i'm going to get back down that particular exercise the reason i say uh leave your head down is because our head is it's the most it's the heaviest thing on our body it's the heaviest part of our body so if you don't leave your head down and keep your head out of this exercise then you're not going to get the benefits because i'll tell you why a lot of people do this with their with their head you see now what's happening there is your head is your head is doing the work so when you leave the head down down here your head is out the, out of the equation now you have to focus on your abs and only your abs because your head is not able to do the work now now you're really engaging your abs okay that's just a little a little tip because sometimes people might keep their head off the off the off the mat and they're working away and they think they're doing fine but they're actually not so anyway bear that in mind little breather everyone a little quick drink we're, uh, we've got one round left coming up. Okay. And it's more of a, it's more of a cardio round, more of a shake out round. All right. It's a, uh, instead of, we, instead of starting with a boxing, kickboxing workout at the start, we're going to finish with it. Okay. We're going to finish with it. Now, just remember, every time um, or, uh, when I do things like jumping jacks or whatever, like for example, the first exercise here is going to be jumping jack, jab, jumping jack, jab the other way, jumping jack, kick, jumping jack, kick. So for the people that maybe might find that even a bit difficult, you can do this, jumping jack, jab, while you're flat on your feet, jumping jack, jab, jumping jack, kick, jumping jack, kick. So there's always something you can do, okay? So anyways, that's the first one. Just follow my lead as I go along. Sorry, I'm just going to, uh, just a small thing here. I'm going to fix it. Just fixing the curtains.
Very good. Okay, right. Okay, let's do it then. So we're going to do it five minutes. Everybody's going to do five minutes. We're not going to worry about stopping after it. 10, 20 seconds, whatever. We're just going to do five minutes straight. Enjoy. Take a break if you want. All right. So, three, two, one. Jump and jack, jab. Jump and jack, jab. Jump and jack, kick. Jump and jack, kick. Jump and jack, jab. Jump and jack, jab. Jump and jack, kick. Jump and jack, kick. Jump and jack, jab. Jack, jab. Jump and jack, kick. Jump and jack, kick. Come on, hit it. Jump and jack. Jab, jump and jack, jab, jump and jack, kick, jump and jack, kick. Okay, change. Hands up, feet, feet, shoulder width apart, elbows pointing to the floor. Roll and roll back around. Bend your legs, not your back. Roll, yes. Start in the center, go back up to the center. Round and back up. Okay, now this time, I'm rolling right, punch right. Rolling left, punch left. With a hook, like a hook. Roll left, punch. Roll right, punch. When you come up, punch when you come up. Roll and punch. Roll and punch. Let's go, come on. Boom. Boom. Yes, very good. Excellent. Now change. One, two, three, four, squat. One, two, three, four, squat. One, two, three, four, squat down. One, two, three, four, squat down. One, two, three, four, squat down. Let's go. One, two, three, four, squat down. Very good. One, two, three, four, squat down. One, four, squat down. Change. One, two, three, slip, slip. So you're moving your hips. One, two, three, slip, slip. One, two, three, slip, slip. Good. One, two, three, slip, slip. Come on, guys. One, two, three, slip, slip. Keep it going. One, two, three, slip, slip. Excellent. Slip, slip. Okay, next one. Uppercuts. One, two, three, four. A little jump. One, two, three, four. A little jump. One, two, three, four, hop. Let's go. One, two, three, four, hop. 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 Excellent. One, two, three, four, hop. Okay, next one. Twist. Left punches right. Right punches left. Three. Four, we're going to do four, then we're going to do lunge, lunge. See that? One, two, three, four. Lunge, lunge. You have to bring your feet with you. Turn your feet, okay? Again, one, two, three, four. Lunge, lunge. Good. One, two, three, four. Lunge, lunge. One, two, three, four. Lunge, lunge. Excellent. Okay. This time we're going to do forward and back. Jab, 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 jab. Come back. Change. Jab, 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 jab. And back. Change. Boom, 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 boom. And back. So I'm going forward and back. Boom, boom. Boom. Yes, and change. Boom, 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 bam. And back. <laughs> Good. Change. Bam, bam. Boom, boom. We've got one minute left. Come on. One minute. Bam, bam. Very good. Okay. Now we'll go back to this one. Jump and jack, jab. Jump and jack, jab. Jump and jack, kick. Jump and jack, kick. Hop, boom. Hop, boom. Keep it going. Last, last 30 seconds. Okay. Next one. One, two, three, four. Squat. One, two, three, four. Squat. Let's go. Let's go. Four and squat. 
four and squat. One, two, three, four and squat. One, two, three, four and squat. Last 20 seconds now, everybody. We're going back to the uppercuts. One, two, three, four and a little jump. One, two, three, four, little jump. Last 15 seconds. Two, three, four, up. One, two, three, four, up. One, two, three, four, up. Five seconds. Two, three, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, and time. Woo! Excellent work. Brilliant. Get a little breather, everyone. Excellent work. Okay, so while we have a while we have a few seconds, I just want to try and use them wisely. We're going to. We have about 10 minutes left, but we're going to finish up in around five. We're just going to do a little cool down, little stretch. But if anyone has a burning question and they'd like to ask it now, you know, just fire away. I'm not going to take 10, 20, but two or three questions if anyone needs, if anyone needs to really ask something, okay? Uh, yeah, so. Um, while, we're rest, while, we're, while we're all here waiting, we're just going to slowly... Slowly cool down, okay? Let the arms flow. That's it. So we're going to be back on Thursday night again for another support group. And, you know, I'm going to talk a little bit more about goal setting, planning, mindset, you know, reaching, your, not just setting your goals, but actually reaching your goals and the kind of resilience that we need to make it happen. So talk a little bit more about that on Thursday. Um, so everybody together now, reach up over the, over the head and stretch, stretch. And breathe and relax, relax, good. One arm across your chest, lock it in with the other arm. Just like this, yeah, in a kind of a, yeah, you're stretching your, sho your shoulder, your tricep, and you're giving a nice little stretch there, yeah. That's it, and breathe. Now, then the other side, the other side, lock it in. I hope you're all enjoying yourselves, guys. The numbers are really great. The numbers are, they're brilliant, and, um, you know, I hope... I hope the others are the, the people that can't make these workouts are doing them at a later time as well because they're really really important. You know they're all going to add to the whole um, to our whole performance on the 19th to 21st of February. We're going to smash it. That's our ultimate goal that we all get out in numbers between those days and we get we 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 go from the house or the couch whatever way you want to phrase it and we cross that line on that five kilometer mark and we do our best and we make sure when we finish that we're we're really really happy with our performance and 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 what we've done and not only do we stop there then we keep up a routine every single week it doesn't have to be five training sessions but we and we try and keep up at least two or three sessions every single week and we make it we incorporate it into our lifestyle we make it part of our lifestyle because in the grand scheme of things, when you think about it, 24 hours in a day, seven days in a week, it's a lot of hours. It's a lot of hours. If we can take two or three of those hours to ourselves every single week, then we deserve that. And we are going to be more effective and we are going to be more productive in all of the other areas of our life, in our working, in our working life, in our parent, while we're parenting, all the other roles and responsibilities that we have. If we focus on ourselves for two or three hours a week, we will be better in all of those other roles. It's a fact. It's a proven fact. It's a scientific study that we will be absolutely more effective and more productive. Okay, change. Down into the lunge and here and hold. And breathe. Good. 
Unchange. Good. And it, actually, I was thinking 24 hours a day, 168 hours a week. 168 hours in a week. We deserve to take two or three of those hours for ourselves every single week. Non-negotiable. Non-negotiable. They're for you, to you, about you. Remember that. Very, very important. Okay, change. Feet pointing away and lean into your groin. We're going to get a nice little stretch on our groin. That's it. And the other side. Lovely work, lovely work. Two feet together. Down and hold. Stretch your hamstring. And shake it out. Okay, let's all finish together in, this, in the customary fashion. Hands down, breathe into your nose, then out your mouth. Ready? In. And out. And well done. Well done, guys. That's brilliant. The reason I finish with this every, uh, every session, I've been doing this for years. I get this vision in my head. It's a, I have this picture in my head that we're like a flower. And every time you train and you look after yourself and you look after your, your, your well-being, I always say that we bloom. We bloom a little bit more every time. So that's why I always, I always finish with that at the end. So anyways, thanks very much, everybody. Thank you. Thanks, Eric. Thank you to everybody. Um, great session, Eric. I love that, the flower um, thing at the end. That's great. Yes. I wondered what it was. That's brilliant. Um, thank you to everybody. Um, have a great week. Um, we will see you on Thursday evening. Take care.